Ladies and gentlemen, can you believe the U.S.-Mexico border was surprisingly calm after the end of the dreaded Title 42? Instead of the utter chaos and pandemonium that many conservatives predicted, the border was as quiet as a mouse in a library. Biden got rid of Title 42 and Governor Greg Abbott is out here accusing him of laying down the welcome mat to people across the entire world. Ah, uh, oh, great. Have you been watching too many disaster movies on Netflix lately? Migrants are even waiting patiently at the border, keeping an eye on their mobile phones, probably playing Candy Crush while they hope to receive their appointment to enter the U.S. legally. Yeah, instead of t across the river from El Paso, Texas, it's like the calm before the storm that never comes. <clears throat> Seriously, folks, there's no rush of people trying to cross. They're behaving like civilized human beings. What a shocker. Some say Title 42 ended with a whimper, but politicians and media won't give up on their drama. Yarning to spin the story into a spectacle of doom and gloom. Talk about a desperate need for rating. Even the new Biden policies have sparked some outrage among critics. Ah, uh, Republicans claim these two lacks of immigration while Democrats say he's too strict. Uh, make up your minds, people. Is this really the 2024 election strategy? Good luck with that. Anyway, the moral of the story is don't believe the hype. Turns out all we got was a bunch of migrants checking their phones, waiting patiently for their turn, and the border chaos was a non-event. Kind of like my birthday party, am I right? This podcast is brought to you by AI Pictures.